How's it going, boys and girls? And welcome back to the channel today. So, massive thank you to Response in uh, um, Daisy video. Obviously, I'm in Daisy today. A little beauty. And I've got, well, you can tell by the title, um, it's some probably one of the best gadgets you can get in a car, especially for a car like this age, for under £10. Like, if you're like me, and you're shit hot, mad on music, love your music, but, like, you kind of want to, you don't want to go down the route of, obviously, getting yourself, like, a new... Um, like being a daily, I don't want to. I don't want to spend loads of money on like stereos and things like that. But you still want to, you know, have like the capability. Capability. That's the one. Capability of having like you know your phone Bluetooth uh, Bluetooth connected to like this gadget which I've got here, so you can play music off your phone, but through an actual standard stereo. So like, say if you've got a standard stereo, that's like mine. It's two thousand eighteen year old car. It hasn't got Bluetooth or anything. Else. It's just a standard radio. Um, it's even got cassette player in it. As I mean, this is how old we're talking here. On eBay, I've, I have found this item. Um, I've known a few mates, I've had it before, and they said it's really good, but I really, this one caught my eye because, you know, it had a lot more different features, and I'll go through the features and that um, as we go throughout the video. So, what it is, is an FM transmitter or converter or something like that, I've called. Um, there you go, that's what it is. It is a car MP3, multifunction uh, multi wireless car MP3 player, T20. I think this is like a Chinese thing. Um, thing, but it is actually like honestly unreal. I've already took out the box, that's why it's ripped. But, uh, yeah, I took, yeah, I've literally took out the box already and tried it all out. And I literally thought, it, I honestly thought it could, I need to stop saying literally. I literally, oh, I was about to say it then. I need, I need to stop this. Honestly, I'll say it honestly now. I honestly could not, st like, couldn't get it in the, the actual, because it fits in where you know the cigarette, say the old cigarette lighter things. It goes in there. So, this is what it is. Um, we'll take it out. It basically acts as it's got two USB chargers as well, so you can charge it up as well. Your phone and that, like to have two people charging on your phone, one on this side, one on the other side. Um, it's obviously a wireless hands free kit, all in this as well, so you don't have to get like a power it or something like that, like you can have in cars. And then it's obviously your car MP3 player as well. So, we'll unbox it quickly. I'll switch the camera around, we'll unbox it, and then yeah, we'll go from there. So this is it. I'm a bit messy doing this one-handed, but it comes in this packaging, comes out like that. It's got your instructions in there inside, and that is literally what it looks like. Obviously, I think you can play your music off that USB as well. So if you plug it in, you can just play your phone music off that instead of connecting it through Bluetooth. But they both act as like chargers anyway. Um, obviously that you can use to like scroll through, uh, make phone calls and stuff like that. And then buttons down there, you can use to change between songs. Um, you can also put, where is it? Like an SD card in there, I believe. So if you wanna play music off an SD card onto your phone, then that's how it works. So what I'm gonna do is basically, We'll pull out the instructions and just basically explain to you what what it actually can do and things like that. Think fully because it'd be a lot easier for you guys to see. So two seconds. So here are the on instructions to basically power it on. Literally, you just oh I keep saying it honestly. Right, you just plug it in. The device comes on automatically when it's plugged into the car. Um, select any frequency you want on your radio or you just select the frequency that is on the um, actual device itself down here and then you can just change it to the frequency on your radio and then turn um, yeah and then you basically just you can adjust the volume on it as well uh, you can adjust the volume actually on there or actually on the on the gadget itself which is down there and then um, and then you can just press the volume. You can change the volume as well by holding down the, the change song buttons. So that's that. Number three, it says, ooh, I'm trying to hold this steady. Insert the, that's so yeah, as you like your SD card or whatever you want to put in, you can just put it in and it will play, as long as it's an MP3 file or one of those files that's actually on the SD card, it will play the music that's on there. And then you basically do the same for the music selection again. Now for Bluetooth devices, you just put it in and it's got a Bluetooth chip in it. So what you do is you just go onto your Bluetooth and your settings like normally. This will come up once it's plugged into the car and then um, you can just click on it. I think it's called T20. Yeah, it comes up saying T20 on there and then connect. Oh yes, it's there. Um, the device has memory function. It automatically clicked to its memorized paired Bluetooth devices when power on. So that's pretty good if you just get in the car. It saves you just basically getting in the car and having to click on it every time it'll just go click to it automatically which is really really helpful and then playing music from mobile phone you literally just go on to 
um, your music on your app, on your phone, uh, like iTunes, whatever you guys use. Play, press play, and then you put it on shuffle, whatever you want to do whilst you're driving. And you can still operate it by just pressing it down there. So, yeah, pretty simple stuff. I will put it in quickly. I can't obviously play music and out of it because I recorded my phone. But this is how it just works. So I had a pickle because I was like, oh, no way, it's not going to fit. It's literally just too big. But with a bit of ease, there you go. It goes in like that, comes on. And then if I start my car up, obviously it's I've got mine set to 108 and start that Bluetooth already. So if I start my car up. So now I have, I have the frequency set to 108 on mine, which is saved, and then that's what it is down there. Unfortunately, you let all you honestly do it, it's that easy. You just plug it in. Well, yeah, plug it in like that. Have your phone playing. You can adjust the volume down there. So I don't know if the volume is going to go up and down on this actually. No, it won't. But yeah, the volume, when you've got a song in it, it will go up and down and stuff like that. So I'll leave that to do its thing. Um, 108, obviously it's Waiting 108. For powering. Yeah, now it's the same way. Oh, it's already paired to my phone actually, apparently. So I don't even have my Bluetooth phone, but oh, my Bluetooth phone's actually on. My bad. But yeah, that's that. Super easy. Now all I've got to do is literally just play music off my phone. Obviously, I can't show you because I can't record and play music at the same time. But yeah, that's how sick it is. So yeah guys, just a quick little simple easy video just to show you guys what it's like. Um, I'll take it out now because I don't need it in. I can turn my car off because yeah. Super easy. I mean, right, I was going to do my then. So easy to do. Simple. I think it cost me like £9, £9.50 or something like that. Um, you may be able to get cheaper ones. I'm pretty sure you might be able to get cheaper ones. But... Like I said, this one took interest to my eye because it had quite a lot, of, like a lot more features. Some of them just have the Bluetooth feature, just play music off it. That's it. Doesn't have any charger ports or anything like that. So yeah, it's really good, really sick, useful bit of kit to have for like that cheap. It's just unreal. Uh, helps me out as well in a car because I can just play my music now instead of listening to the radio all the time. So yeah, guys, wrap this video up here. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. It's something cheap, easy, cheap and cheerful, easy to do, and yeah, I love it. It's sick. And, oh, have you not had, have you ever had any one of these as well? Chris gave me one yesterday, lavender. Not really feeling it though, but yeah. Anyway, we're not talking about that. So yeah, lads, thanks for watching as always. If you're new, subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit that bell, bu bell button as well so you be notified every single time I upload. Check out my social media links. They're all in the description down below. We've got things coming for Daisy the Daily. Don't you worry, lads. Um, comment down below what you'd like to see next. Obviously, we're on coilovers in that at the minute. Should I get some wheels? Um, do you reckon it's possible for me, to, myself, to get this dent out that's in my rear quarter panel or within the arch? If it is, comment down below, lads. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Check out my social media links, guys. That's where I am most of the time. But, yeah, thanks for watching as always. I'll see you all in the next video. Love you all as always. Bye-bye for now. Oh, my God, oh, my God. If I die, I'm a legend. When they lay me down to rest, I know I was always repping. Oh, my God, my whole life. My words been my greatest weapon I know